Hey everybody, TV Ben here with Willie the Cat. We are outside. Why? Because that just showed up. It's my Black Knight Topper. So, thank you Little Shop of Games. We've been waiting since January. It's not their fault. It's, uh, really, it's nobody's fault. Uh, manufacturing delays, back orders, everything else due to how 2020 is going. But, it's here. So let's get this in the house and open it up. Okay, we're upstairs, so let's open it up. All right, went in for a closer look because the uh, packing was well done on the packing, no complaints. Looks pretty cool. It's gonna look better lit up. I would have bet just from the videos I saw that the, I mean, here's to scale, not that I have the biggest hands ever, but I thought the, I thought he uh, was a little bit larger than that, but that's okay. It still looks really cool. So let's see what else came in the box. We've got instructions, warning, do not move head by hand. All right. Okay. Before we move on to the back box, we've got uh, installing the feather. So carefully hold the head, loosen the Phillips screw, insert the feather into the bracket. Using a small regular screwdriver, carefully slide the bracket towards the feather, carefully tighten. Okay. There it is. We've got one feather. Push that forward. Okay, feather install. So we've got the back box open. I've got the tripod up as high as it'll go because we're working about six and a half feet off the ground here. There's four screws to remove. And you gotta hold on to them for later because guess what, you're gonna put them, that's what's gonna uh, attach this back. We have opened the back box. We've taken out, uh, the plug for that hole. We've also removed four screws from the top of the game. I did that for you off camera so you don't have to be bored with that. We gotta carefully run the wires down. Do not hit your ceiling fan. Ethernet cable is going to CN12, and then we've got the power connection here. So we need to route our cables down. All right. There's CN12. Okay, that didn't leave us a lot of room to work with, but we go down to CN7 on the power board down here. And it's a keyed connector, so you can't mess that up. But yeah, you gotta kind of run the power not not as cleanly as I would like, but Good. Power on test with the Black Knight head, topper, whatever we're calling it here. There he is. That is cool. That is really cool. Alright, one last thing. So after the reveal, I was looking at it, I was like, alright, so... This is the back, obviously. I had to take the back cover off 
So there's the board for it. And so you can see in there, you can see that's the flame effect for the one side over here and the flame effect for the other side over here. Well, it's working now, but it wasn't. Um, so what ended up happening, um, one, <laughs> nobody checked it before it left or they would have seen that. Um, can we get down in there enough to see it? See that screw right back there, straight back, that one back there. This little yellow wire, as you can see, was pinched in that bracket for the screw, causing it not to work. So luckily, once I freed it and uh, kind of bent the wire a little bit and replugged it back in, we're working. But I was about to be uh, very disappointed there. But slight, slight detour, nothing big, nothing we couldn't fix. So now we got to button this back up on the back and then, then gameplay. Okay, on to the gameplay. Here we go. Well, now we roll. <laughs> Ooh, he's laughing at us. I do like that. Got it. Interaction's pretty cool, honestly. Oh, got duffed. Have some napalm. Super feature ready. All right, we got that open. Let's see if we can. Super targets. Ah, not the best. All right, got another ball lock. Catapult ball two, locked. Oh. I will not spare you again. Alright, we've got last chance. So let's lock one of them. Got it. Cool. Catapult multi ball super. Nice. Woo! In the glass. I will tear you apart. Yeah, interaction. I like it.
So there you have it. There's your gameplay video. What did you think? Personally, I think it's a really good looking topper. It's got good interaction with the game. I don't think it's worth $500. But thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you next time.